Hey everyone, Crash from Crash Customs, Lake Havasu, Arizona. I got a quick product review for you, tool review, Harbor Freight. Harbor Freight, can't beat the price. Spray gun, I originally bought this gun just to uh, shoot some varnish through on a truck bed floor I was doing. And uh, the gun worked so good, I cleaned it. My original plan was just to use it, toss it, move on back to my SADA gun for the paint work that I do. But it worked so good, I cleaned it and I've been using it I've been using it quite a bit on this product, Liquid Wrap, dipyourcar.com, and uh, it, it shoots the flake awesome. I never even adjusted it. I put the product in and I just started spraying. It works really good. And like I said, Harbor Freight, so the price is right. I usually keep an extra one in stock just in case it goes bad, but I don't even know how many times I've used this one for, for product, and it works great. So, you do got to assemble it, but it's super easy. Super easy. There's directions here. I, you know, I, I don't need those, but if you're new to it, read them. And uh, when you put it all together, make sure you run some uh, cleaner through it, because the parts are... Uh, greasy and oily when they assemble it, but It's a it's a great gun for the money. I got other guns that are Crazy stupid expensive. They work awesome, too, but for product that you don't want to put through your really good guns This is the way to go and uh, I really I wouldn't even feel bad about getting one just for good color good paint and uh, You know real automotive paint not a liquid wrap like this so I will spray that that's what we're doing we're spraying that and all these pieces with the liquid wrap with the Harbor Freight gun 1.4 tip and uh, I'll show you how good it works Harbor Freight spray gun for the win. Just sprayed this a couple days ago. 67 Mustang for my sister. And I'm also gonna throw in a product review along with the tool review. This is Plasti Dip, dipyourcar.com. Peelable paint, liquid wrap, however you want to uh, label it. This one is called Carmine Red. Look at when the light hits that. I can't wait to pull this out into the sun. It's uh, red, obviously, 
with a real fine, like goldish pearl metallic in it. And uh, I based it with anthracite gray metallic, real fine metallic. So some of the miscellaneous trim pieces we pulled and left anthracite gray. So there will be no chrome on this car. Here's part of the grill assembly. Gray, horse, carmine red, obviously. Side mirror. It is uh, unbelievably affordable, especially if you're comparing it to real paint. The product alone is way more affordable. And uh, the labor, if you got a straight vehicle, all you do is wash it with dish soap, degrease it, get it really clean, tape it, and spray it. That's that's what you do to prep it. So if you got like a, a, a nice clean ride with no dings or dents, it's like a weekend project if you hustle, as opposed to a, you know real paint i i compare it to like a, a vinyl wrap and uh i actually like it way better than a vinyl wrap because i didn't have to use a heat gun a razor blade to uh, cut reliefs or cut edges this is spray it and it sticks and when you're done with it you put enough coats on it's uh, pretty easy to peel off with no glue residue like uh, a vinyl wrap would have. Plus, the glue from a vinyl wrap actually kind of eats into the clear coat if you look close enough. And I've seen, uh, I've seen Ferraris get unwrapped and there's razor blade slash marks in the original paint everywhere. You don't have that with this. Super durable. It has a coating like a clear coat they call it dip armor let me show you the cans got them right out here still so this first one was the anthracite gray that i based it two coats then the carmine red put six coats of that on and then the dip armor you actually got to mix it but they make it super easy they tell you exactly how to do it and i put two coats of that on it uh it's it, it's really a, a nice top coat. It's kind of, well, I, I think it's stronger than a ceramic coat on a paint job. When it gets wet, the water just runs right off of it super easy. And I've seen guys take their wad of car keys and slide them across the hood. No scratches. Super durable. Did our kind of daily beater like probably five years ago in Wicked Wine. And this sits outside all the time never gets any garage time it's just our driver but look at that it's a little dirty but oh man that flake in there super fine super nice and i got one more to show you one more to show you real quick satin black on an old school old old school like this old school this is my mom and stepdad's Suburban, we're doing a motor swap in it right now, but the black on here, Plasti Dip, super durable. The purple is paint by, I don't know who, somebody else, not me, but look at that satin black. Super nice, and it is it is durable. A little dusty in here, but this thing will clean up real nice. Three vehicles in here. One's mine, two family members. They, they, the product works awesome. And to me, if you're gonna do paint, I only wanna do like full show paint because the product is so expensive, your time is so expensive. It, to me, it's pointless just to squirt it or do a paint job. This is great. When she's ready for the killer paint job, peel this prep it, go to town, months and months and months of making it super straight, and a uh, couple weeks of cut and buff on it, she'll have it. But for now, this is awesome. This super durable. I love it. This is actually the second time we dipped her car. Let me show you 
I got a chunk that we peeled off of it. And then this was probably like six years old. But I like to I like to keep it around just to show people. I believe this was off the trunk lid. One big chunk. It was a pretty neat color. Kind of like a, a copper color. That's the back side. Not sticky at all. And it it came off. Came off really easy. It was like like I said, it was like six years old. Held up real good. Got the job done. She just wanted a different look. So now she does. And so I did that, sprayed that with the Harbor Freight gun. It worked so good, I cleaned it again. Ready to go another round. I like using it for the Plasti Dip, varnish for wood beds, whatever. I'd even put real paint through it because it works so good. Let me know what you guys think in the comments about the Harbor Freight spray gun. I think Harbor Freight has totally upped their game in the last few years. They have a lot of good tools, a lot of good products that I use in the shop and uh, we beat them up. We beat them up all the time. And uh, if they do break, I don't feel bad about it because they were so affordable. What hurts is when you spend big money on tools and you're just using them as they should be and they fail. It, 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 it hurts me, it hurts me spending all that money on stuff and then they fail. Much rather spend the money at Harbor Freight and uh, not be disappointed with the price at all. And like I said, they, they hold up, they hold up real good, so. Also let me know what you guys think about the liquid wrap, dipmycar.com. Great alternative to a vinyl wrap. I ain't much for vinyl wraps. And like if you're dailying your stuff, man, you can't beat it for the price. I, it, it doesn't even compare to uh, real paint when, you, when you're talking about price. Parents, they daily drive this. My woman, she daily drives our Durango. My sister's Mustang, she used the heck out of that when it was copper, and now she's gonna use the heck out of it in Carmine Red. So, how can you beat it? Look real good. So, like, comment, and subscribe, and uh, let me know in the comments. Thanks. Please like, comment, and subscribe. We really do appreciate it. Let Crash know in the comments what you think of the tool and product reviews.